A federal minister has denied that the woman named as the owner of two companies that allegedly misappropriated funds for the 9 billion ringgit literal combat ship project was his wife. Abdul Latif Ahmad said that Zainab Mohamad Saleh was not his wife as claimed. The special functions minister said in a brief statement that he was prepared to cooperate with the authorities who want to probe this matter further. While Latif did not specify the news report, he may have been referring to a now-deleted Twitter thread linking a certain Zainab Mohamad Saleh to the LCS controversy. Earlier today, PKR Deputy President Rafi Ziramli claimed that Latif's wife was the owner of the two companies that had siphoned the funds and that the companies were appointed as technical consultants and suppliers of spare parts that had sent invoices for work that was never done. In a statement, Rafizi claimed that the two companies bore names similar to a French company and were registered as offshore companies in Malta and Labuan. He said that as much as 243 million ringgit was misappropriated. He also said the schemes to misappropriate LCS funds using companies allegedly linked to Latif, who was then the Deputy Defence Minister, was no coincidence. On August 8, Rafizi claimed that he was in possession of leaked documents that gave the impression that a deal for the LCS was predetermined even before the government signed its agreement with Bausted Naval Shipyards in Dirian Burhad. <laughs>